significant little something something i went doing the black friday crystal had me out in the world on the black uh and the friday okay i don't go out on black friday i stay inside and drink tea and hot cocoa and order offline i, get... I don't like large crowds in busy places i don't i can't be on my guard it's too much going on i can't i gotta be mm -mm. Anywho, I went Black Friday shopping. Savers had 70% off all of their dresses, bottoms, um, pants and skirts, and jeans up to noon. So me and my friend, me and Crystal got there around about 9, 30, 10 o'clock. No, 10 o'clock. And Mash Gash threw a whole bunch of stuff in the car, tried it on, and got to check out before 12. I did get a few things after 12 o'clock, but those are not important. And some of those are like housewares and books. You guys know how I like books. So, anywho, I'm going to jump right into it. First thing I got is something I'm so excited about. This is going to be our holiday DIY. You guys know I'm going to give you some holiday DIYs. And it is this vintage throwback retro, I don't even know what it's called, a bejeweled, sprinkled, bedazzled dress set. So cute. How cute. Oh, me holding it up does nothing for us. I'm going to show you online. This thing is old. It is outdated. So, you know your girl got to take it and spruce it up. So, you guys stay tuned for the uh, for the DIY for this. This is going to be a cute holiday dress. Um, I love I love the material that the dress is made of. I love the style, like the cut of the dress. However, I am not a fan of these little cardigan-looking flaps here. It completely outdates it. And then it has the nerves that have shoulder pads. Think it back in the day. Um, I I want to make just to tell you guys my style. And you guys let me know if y'all see it. I think I'm gonna take these little cardigan little flaps and make them sleeves and make the sleeves longer. Just because this material is not very nice on the skin, it's actually kind of like itchy and annoying. So I'm thinking the long sleeves will help with that, so I can be able to deal with it if I do decide to wear this out on New Year's or at a any party between now and then. Um, real cute, love the sparkle detail into this. I will be the disco ball, everyone will see me. So cute, and it's basically just like a little simple black dress, but a little bit more extra fun. Next piece is a piece that's not, you know, as fun as that one, but you know. It's the thrift store, they all can't be winners. Um, it is this black and orange striped pencil skirt from Torrid. Yes, from Torrid. Oh, this dress was... $8.94 and I got it for 70% off. You do math. Anywho, um, is this striped pencil skirt from Tori from my last video, my plus size guide to um, important pieces to have. I talk about the importance of a pencil skirt. I love a pencil skirt. I wish I got this pencil skirt a month or two ago because this would be real cute with some tights and booties and a sweater for the fall. Real cute. I don't know if I'm going to get much wear out of it now because this is on the thin side of material. This is probably like a medium weight knit. Very good stretch. Wide waistband. Always important for uh, in, in, in any bottoms. Especially for plus size people. Um, this was $3.99. Uh, so I got 70% off. Again, you do the math. This was in a size 4. I usually go for a 5. So this is a bit snug. And I am trying everything on without shapewear. So, you guys can see how it truly looks on me. So, yes. Next piece is something I'm really excited about. And it is these pair of jeans. I got me some jeans. I need more jeans in my life. And I got me some jeans. Uh, these are Lizzie and Me. And I believe that is a either runway or a woman within brand. Or they sold on Roman women within. 
anywho um it's liz and me and these is a size 28 wide they are cropped they're not cropped but they're really short on me because of my butt my butt eats up lunch like it's a meal and so i'm thinking of wearing these almost like a boyfriend jeans i'm gonna distress them a little bit a lot i haven't decided and cuff them and they're gonna be some cute little uh jeans that i throw on uh, but this is in the size i already said it's 23 it's 28 and this was 3.99 plus 75 percent off you do the math next piece is something that i have destroyed trying on i feel so bad i'm gonna fix this i really am and it is this beautiful beaded vintage skirt like look at this a line skirt like all oh, this off-white cream and these iridescent beads can y'all see it I hope it's not washing it out, but oh my god. Uh, this was in a size 3X. This was also $3.99 plus 75% off. Um, I ripped it up trying to try it on. It's, it's real snug and real tight. So I'm going to see what I can do with this. I don't want to cut it up and make it something new because this is vintage and that's sacrilege. I don't need to cut in everything up. Some things just... So, I'm going to see if something I can do with this. If not, I'm going to have to pass it on and give it to my mom. I'm sad. Because she didn't find this I did, and it's mine. But it's so cute. I love vintage. I love vintage. Look at the, look at the hem, though. Y'all see that, that leaf hem, though? Like, seriously. It don't make stuff like this no more. Ah! Okay, last few pieces that I didn't get from Savers this past Friday. I got them a week ago, two weeks ago, from a small little thrift store at in um, Short North on Clark when I was there with my friend Wanda. She took me to this thrift store that I do not like. That thrift store is just, it's too much. It's too much stuff in it. Stuff is stopping on top of each other. And it was 50% off. And everybody named Mama was in the store. That's, I told you, I don't like busy, loud, crowded places. It makes it makes me feel unsafe and i'm from the hood so that should tell you something okay so first thing is this large grandpa um grandpa cable knit sweater this thing is a hot mess this is from Dre crew this is x l t this was four dollars half off so it was basically two dollars love this kind of uh i don't even know kind of taupey brown color i love the cable knit now this is complete this is so itchy i think i'm gonna line this or wear it under like wear it over like a long sleeve shirt because like extra lame because this is extreme this is one of them itchy sweaters i guess this kind of sweater that you wear over a button-up shirt because it would itch the crap out of you it will bug the crap out of you and wear this against your skin but it was $2. It fits. I could probably wear this like a long dress because it's so long. I'll probably wear it with some shorts and some tights. Real cute. Just itchy. Last piece, speaking of itch, is this large one size fit all cape coat. Oh my god, this thing is like 90% 90% wool. Extremely itchy. I love the bat wing. I didn't think this was gonna fit on me. Because they said once I fit all on my yeah, right. I try to know anyway. Perfect fit. It comes with a detachable hood. I think I'm gonna line this, especially around the collar and the sleeves, because again, 90% wool, it's itchy. But this is an amazing find. This was either six to eight dollars, and I got that half off. Love. Yes.